That doesn't look wow. good. It looks Oh painful. my gosh. What's yeah. going on here? Was Ew. Blady procedure did this to her brain. Ew. Hey guys, it's Buya at Pula Kilai. But welcome back to my channel. Usong usong ngayon yung microblading, di ba? Kasi gusto natin yung brows natin ngayon. Napaka hair like, napaka natural lang. But what if there is microblade na mura, maganda, at saka pain free? I'm talking about Snowy Beauty Inks What's Up Brow Eyebrow Embroidery. Ayan, bago nilang product to. Tapos, nag-release sila ng tatlong shades. Sa video na to, itatry on ko yung mga products na binigay ng Snowy. And I will also review them for you. Before we start, I'm just gonna put out my little disclaimer here na these products were given to me by Snowy. But, rest assured, my review on the products will be 100% real and honest. I believe kasi na honest reviews will help consumers sa decision making nila whether or not to buy the products. And I also believe that honest reviews will help companies up their game even more. So that's why I want to keep everything 100. And also guys, as this is a review video, some products may work for me, some products may not, and you may agree or disagree, but let's just respect each other's opinions kasi iba-iba tayong body types, iba-iba tayong preferences. So, wag tayo mag-hate on sa each other's opinions, okay? Let's start! These products are from Snowy Beauty Inc. Snowy? Snow? How do you pronounce it? Snowy? I think this is a part of their What's Up Brow na line. So, this is their eyebrow embroidery. Sa eyebrow embroidery nila, nag-release sila ng tatlong shades. And the shades are Rust, Khaki, and Ochre. Tapos yung claims nila ay Real Hair Effect, Highly Pigmented, Water Resistant, and it lasts for 24 hours. Yung lightest shade nila ay yung Khaki, next is Rust, and next is Ochre. Yung Rust, medyo may pagka-red tone siya. So if my hair dye kayo na parang reddish, then the shade Rust is for you. Pero if same tayo na medyo may pagka-dark hair, brown, then you can go for ochre. And then if you have a blonde hair, then you can go for khaki. But as for me, I've already tried this kasi. I like to mix both khaki and ochre. Or sometimes I just go with khaki. And the product costs for 499 pesos. So this is what it looks like. And you na notice ko sa packaging, wala dito yung shade name. As in the actual word na ochre khaki rust. Wala dito. So it's pretty confusing, especially for those people na hindi sila color oriented. Hindi nila ma differentiate yung khaki, the rust, or a certain kind of color to a certain kind of color. So you'll never know which one. So nga, I always have to refer to the box and match the shade here. Dito. And then add ito pala. It belongs here. This one is ochre. This one is rust. I have to do that. And that for me is hassle. Kasi you don't bring boxes all the time, especially when you're going to work. It's just a very little detail. I just want na ayan na yung shade name, yung actual word, it's here. I want it there. Okay, I'm confused. Which one again is ochre? Oh my goodness. Na wala ko na naman. See, this is what. I'm telling you guys, I'm actually drawn to the shade Khaki because it's the pinaka lightest. Although I'm not sure if this is Khaki. Are you Khaki? But if you are Khaki, ayan nga, I always use the shade Khaki. Um, I I use the shade Khaki because it's the pinaka lightest. Bakit? Because the product na to, I only use it sa brow head ko. Kasi medyo sparse yung hair dito. Kaya I want to fill it in with hair-like strokes. And gusto ko lang very light color. Kasi pag masyadong dark, parang boxy yung eyebrows. So, no. No, no, no to that. I only put hair-like strokes dito. At saka hindi na dito sa may brow tail area. Kasi sa brow tail naman, for me kasi, I have enough hair there. Na I don't feel the need to add more hair-like strokes. And what I put sa rest of my brows is actually my favorite trick. It's the mascara trick. This is what the Trident tip looks like. Parang ano talaga siya? Parang tool talaga siya for microblading. So when you're applying this, remember lang na dapat you have to have light strokes. Kasi you're applying sa brow head eh. So if I follow ko lang yung natural line ko at dyan na ako mag-apply ng hair-like strokes. Yan. See? And always remember nyo guys, kung saan yung direction ng brow hair nyo, it follow nyo lang talaga para maging natural looking talaga siya. See guys, compare nyo sa other side. Na lengthen yung brow ko compared dito. Ayan.
Medyo mahirap lang siya pantayin, guys. Especially pag beginner kayo. Nako! It looks dark lang. You have to powder it down. But I actually like it kasi it's so bushy. It's so natural looking. And for the rest of my brows, I like to apply my Hyper Curl Mascara from Maybelline. Dapat tuyo siya, guys. Kasi kung fresh pa, nako, medyo magka-come off strong talaga siya. So what I do, I go to the brow tail first. Tapos, I go against the brow growth. Doon muna. Pa dun tayo, kasi dito yung brow growth eh. So, opposite direction tayo. Para pumasok talaga yung pigment, guys. And then, let's comb it back. And what I also like to do, I also brush the brow hair upwards. <gasps> See? Super pack. Oh, ayan. Oh. 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 Diba? Compared nyo dito, oh. Look at the difference. Oh, the kilay here is so dead. But this one, my kulay, it's so beautiful. Ganda, no? Ganda. Wow. Wow, self-praise. <laughs> Pero ang ganda. I-try nyo sa eyebrows, you guys. Magagandaan talaga kayo ng bongga. <gasps> so pretty. I've never seen my brows so pretty like this one. Wow. Yes to hair like strokes! Wow! So nice! So I'm done doing my brows. Ay nga, hindi siya like the usual na pantay na pantay talaga na kailangan gudun talaga o may structure talaga. Eto, in-enhance ko lang talaga yung brow hair ko. Tsaka in-extend ko dito by using the eyebrow embroidery. Hindi siya even, which is Totally normal kasi yung eyebrows, diba? They are not twins. They are sisters, diba? May quote na ganyan. I like the unevenness to it. And I really like how natural it looks. So, ayan nga. Ay, ay! I like it so much. I hope you try out this also. So, for the application, I really like that it is a trident tip. Kasi tatlong strokes agad magagawa mo in one go, diba? But what I don't like lang... You know me and my thing with felt tips. I feel like kasi felt tip makeup run out of products easily. So yun ang concern ko for this one kasi this one aims to create hair-like strokes. So I don't know lang kung ano yung performance niya in the long run. If sharp pa ba siya or if it will go dull. Kasi once this goes dull, hindi na fine yung hair-like strokes na magagawa ninyo. I will definitely continue to use this product, but I hope lang, ayun nga, hindi siya maging dull. For the pricing naman na $499, may kamahalan siya for an eyebrow product. I feel like it's expensive for me kasi yung use ko lang for this one is on the brow head, and I really don't use it sa the rest of the brow parts. I really can't make the most out of the pricing na $499. But for people who have thinner eyebrows, tapos gusto niyo ma-achieve yung hair-like strokes, I think $499 is worth the try. If gusto niyo pain-free yung microblade niyo, you want to achieve a very natural-looking brows, I think it is really worth the try. Kasi napakaganda ng effect niya sa kilay. For the packaging, hands down, maganda talaga yung packaging ng Snowy. I think napaka-world-class talaga yung packaging ng Snowy. But yun lang, I hope sa future releases ng eyebrow embroidery nila, uh, ilagay nila yung shade name kasi I really want to know what the name is. And another thing for application, if you're a beginner or hindi nyo pa na master yung skill of eyebrow making, this will be a bit difficult for you. Yung difficulty niya, hindi siya involved sa product ha. It's not because of the product. But it's because of making hair-like strokes in general. Because you really, really have to have light hands. You really have to be careful with it and confident at the same time. Because if you're not confident when applying your hair-like strokes, na ako makikita talaga yung takot sa hairs niyo, sa hairs niyo. All in all, I think the product is great. It is worth the try. Because ang ganda ng effect niya talaga sa kilay. Tapos it really looks na parang nagpa microblade na ako. If you want a pain-free micro blading session and you want to have bomb brows, then this is for you. This is really worth the try because it's so beautiful. It's so... Again, if you like this video, please do give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and share this video. If you have any comments or suggestions, then please do enter them down in the comment section below. Just remember, no hate, just love.